Celebrity wives who started out as mistresses. Let's face it, some men cheat. Women who have affairs with married men are often told, he'll never leave his wife for you. In many cases, that's true. But in this video, we'll show you why you should never say never. These celebrity romances might have started out as messy entanglements, but they somehow turned their affairs into real love and went from being the side chick to become the main chick. Join us in today's video as we show you which celebrity wives made it down the aisle to say I do after starting out as mistresses and which couples are still living happily ever after. Let's get started. Giselle Bündchen and Tom Brady when these two began dating in 2006, he was reportedly still in a relationship with actress Bridget Moynihan. The end of Tom's relationship with Bridget and the start of his romance with Giselle seemed to overlap. Just two months after he started his romance with Giselle, Bridget announced she was three months pregnant with Tom's child. Sounds like a mess, but luckily everything worked out. In an interview with Details Magazine, Tom said, That's not how you envisioned your life. That's not how you envisioned having children, but it happens. By February 2009, Tom married Giselle in a secret wedding in Santa Monica. We planned it in like 10 days and it was perfect, Tom stated to GQ that November. In addition to enjoying her role as a stepmother, Giselle also appears to get along well with Bridget. Giselle and Tom now have two children together, son Benjamin and daughter Vivian. Gwen Stefani and Blake Shelton from good friends to lovers. These two started dating in 2015 and have been together ever since. Blake and Gwen originally became acquainted while working as coaches on The Voice alongside Adam Levine and Pharrell Williams. Gwen and Blake were each married at this time, Gwen to Gavin Rosdale and Blake to Miranda Lambert. Although it was clear that Blake and Gwen hit it off, they both denied the rumors of being together. In July 2015, after four years of marriage, Blake and Miranda finally decided to divorce. The following month, Gwen announced her divorce after being with Gavin for 20 years. By November 2015, Blake and Gwen confirmed they were dating. Stefani told Ryan Seacrest, To be super honest, it is kind of crazy we both went through the same thing at the same time, adding that they bonded through their divorces. In October 2020, the couple got engaged. They got married in July 2021 and still look happy as ever. Johnny Depp and Amber Heard these two met on the set of The Rum Diary in 2011. Although it's never been confirmed or denied, they were rumored to have hooked up while filming together. At that time, he was still with Vanessa Parody, his partner of 14 years, who he shares two children with. Apparently, Johnny was having an affair with Amber Heard while still dating Vanessa, which caused the long-term couple to split. They announced their breakup in 2012, and he later married Amber Heard in 2015 on a private island in the Bahamas. His rocky marriage to Amber only lasted 15 months, and their divorce was finalized in January 2017. Tori Spelling and Dean McDermott In 2005, Tori Spelling and Dean McDermott were both married to other people when they met on the set of Mind Over Murder. Tori was married to Charlie Shanian, while Dean was married to Mary Jo Eustace. They were openly unfaithful to their partners, and their marriages ended in 2006 due to their infidelity. Tori admitted on the couple's reality show, True Tori, that she slept with Dean the first night they were together. A month after Tori's divorce from Charlie was finalized, she married Dean in 2007. Although their own marriage hasn't been without controversy, together they now have five children. Kelsey Grammer and Kate Walsh Kelsey was married to the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star Camilla Grammer for 14 years before marrying Kate Walsh. Kate and Kelsey met on a flight to England in December 2009, where Kate was working as a flight attendant. According to Kelsey, it was love at first sight. A few days later, they went out for coffee in London, and that was the beginning of their romance. Kate told Oprah, I'm not proud of the way we started out because he was in a marriage. I'm sorry as well. There's so many emotions, but I fell in love. I don't know how to put it into words. Although she is 25 years younger than him, the pair had an affair for six months while he was still married. Later, Kelsey admitted to Camilla that he no longer wanted to be married. Fifteen days after his divorce was finalized in 2011, he married Kate. The pair have two children together, Faith and Kelsey. Alicia Keys and Swizz Beats Alicia Keys and rapper-producer Swizz Beatz started dating in 2008. At the time, he was still married to Mashonda Tiffray, who had just given birth to their son, Kasim Dean Jr. Though Swizz claimed he and Mashonda had already been separated, she had a different story. In 2009, she accused Alicia of destroying a family in a lengthy Twitter post. I feel that after one and a half years of you hiding this affair and acting like it doesn't exist, that now is the time to confront it, since you talk so openly about it now. You have no idea how much pain I was caused by this affair. Swiss and Alicia got engaged in 2009 and had a wedding on the French island of Croatia in July 2010. The couple share two sons together, Egypt and Genesis. Gabrielle Union and Dwayne Wade 
When these two initially met, they were chosen to co-host a Super Bowl party in 2007. At the time, Wade was still married to his high school sweetheart, Siobhan Funches. Meanwhile, Union had recently divorced former NFL player Chris Howard. By July 2010, the couple went public with their relationship. That month, they displayed PDA when Gabrielle watched Wayne play in the All-Star Game in Miami. Four years later, in 2014, the pair had an intimate wedding in Miami, surrounded by their family and friends. She welcomed becoming a stepmom to his three sons and his nephew, who he gained full custody of. In November 2018, the couple welcomed their own daughter, Kavia James, via surrogate. Ethan Hawke and Ryan Shaw Hughes Prior to his relationship with Ryan, Ethan was married to Pulp Fiction icon Uma Thurman, with whom he has two children. As Hawk and Thurman's marriage began to fall apart, rumors spread that he was having an affair. Hawk, on the other hand, insists that their divorce was not due to infidelity, but rather the problems of being married to another famous actor. Despite his denials, rumors swirled that he had cheated on Thurman with their then-nanny, Shaw Hughes. Following his breakup with Thurman, Hawk claimed to have started dating Shaw Hughes when they crossed paths in a park. By 2008, Ethan and Ryan tied the knot. She's now an actor and producer and has moved behind the camera to work with Hawk on other films like First Reformed and Blaze. Julia Roberts and Danny Motor the two first met on the set of The Mexican in 2000, where Danny was a cameraman and Julia starred in the film with Brad Pitt. They struck up a romance even though Motor was married to makeup artist Ferris Steinberg and Roberts was dating fellow actor Benjamin Bratt. Six months into his romance with Roberts, Motor filed for divorce from Steinberg after four years of marriage. She was devastated and not ready to divorce. It took some time before she signed the divorce papers. Despite a rough beginning, Motor and Roberts wed in 2002 and have three kids together, twins Phineas and Hazel and son Henry. They've been together for over 20 years and are still going strong. Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt for years, Jennifer Aniston and Brad Pitt were happily married and Hollywood's it couple, and then he met Angelina on the set of their 2004 spy thriller, Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Rumors sparked he was cheating, but the two insisted there was no affair. They both eventually acknowledged they fell in love on set despite their initial denial of a relationship. In January 2005, amidst the cheating allegations, Pitt and Aniston announced their separation after five years of marriage. Three months after Pitt's divorce from Aniston was finalized, Brad and Angelina confirmed they were expecting their first baby together. And by July 2008, they welcomed their twins, Knox Leon and Vivian Marshallane. Brad and Angelina dated for eight years before tying the knot in France in August 2014. But by September 2016, she ended up filing for divorce, citing irreconcilable differences. They've been locked in a messy court battle ever since. Leanne Rimes and Eddie Cibrian this pair starred together in the Lifetime movie The Northern Lights in 2009. She was married to backup dancer Dean Sheremet while he was married to Brandy Glanville, who he shared two sons with. But despite them both being married to other people, the two carried on an affair while filming, and their romance was made public by the press. They both divorced their partners to be with one another, and the two married in 2011. Leanne has said, I take responsibility for everything I've done. I hate that people got hurt, but I don't regret the outcome. In 2021, they celebrated their 10th wedding anniversary. Melanie Griffith and Antonio Banderas Both Melanie Griffith and Antonio Banderas were married to other people when they met and fell in love in 1995 on the set of Too Much. At the time, she was married to Don Johnson and he was married to Anna Liza. A month after both divorces were finalized, the pair got married and welcomed a daughter that same year. The two became one of Hollywood's longest-running couples, but after almost 20 years together, they eventually filed for divorce in 2014, citing irreconcilable differences. Kevin Hart and Aniko Parrish there's no official date of when Kevin and Aniko first met. However, Kevin's ex-wife Tori Hart has claimed his relationship with Aniko was the downfall of their marriage. Tori and Kevin got married in 2003, and after Kevin's public infidelity scandal, they got divorced in 2011. In a since-deleted comment, Aniko has said, Their marriage was broken way before I came into the picture. They were separated, living in separate homes. I was never a secret. She added that Tori only singled her out as a mistress despite knowing he was involved with other women because because her relationship with Kevin stuck. Aniko and Kevin tied the knot in 2016 after seven years of dating. The pair have since welcomed two children together, and even though he has been involved in other cheating scandals, they still look happily married. Some say if he cheated to be with you, he'll probably cheat on you. Do you think once a cheater, always a cheater? What are your thoughts about these celebrity wives who started out as mistresses? Let us know by leaving a comment below.